Let us not allow those who are motivated by hate to separate us or to make us feel fear. Let us not allow that. Instead, as we all know, it is a time to renew our commitment to fight for unity, to remind our communities that we all have so much more in common than what separates us. That if we are to maximize our strength as a nation, we must find a way to commit to come together with a principle that includes believing that a harm against any one of us is a harm against all of us. To combat hate, we cannot be silent. And we must have the courage to speak truth about what fuels these crimes as we work to come together as a society. And so let us speak out. No 86-year-old should fear for her safety to go to the grocery store. No nine-year-old should be afraid to go to school. And no 18-year-old should be able to buy a weapon of war. The president spoke last night, and he said, and I think many of us know and agree, we need to pass common sense gun safety laws. Common sense. We need to take action. And we know it is even more clear this day, just after the massacre of those 19 babies in Uvalde, after the killing just two days ago in Tulsa of four people, and after the countless lives lost to gun violence every day on streets across America. So it's clear that we must renew the assault weapons ban. We must expand background checks. We must repeal the liability shield that protect, protects gun manufacturers. And we must pass red flag laws to prevent people from possessing firearms if they are a danger to themselves or others. The U.S. Conference of Mayors has been a strong advocate on so many of these issues, on sensible gun laws, by my count, for well over half a century. And so again, I thank you. And in conclusion, I ask you, please continue to make your voices heard. Please continue to use your bully pulpit to fight for safer communities, for more economic opportunity, and for all the things that you so uniquely understand and know that our families need to succeed and to thrive. And I know that each of you is up to this challenge because you are the mayor. Thank <laughs> you.